Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel MV's Code Guide. Today we are going to learn how to remove duplicate characters in a particular string. Now this can be very useful when we take data from user at runtime uh, and if the user adds some duplicate or unwanted characters mistakenly, we need to have that code to remove those unwanted duplicate characters. So let us try to solve this problem and see how we can code for this. Now before jumping directly to the coding part, let me tell you how to approach this problem. Suppose your input is like this, where each and every character is present more than once and you are expecting an output uh, to be like somewhere like A, B, C and D. So what I need to do is first of all, I'll create an object, an empty object and name it as output. Okay, I'll name it as output. Okay, so this is an empty object. I'm not going to add anything here right now. What I'll do is I'll traverse this string. Traverse it one by one and check if the character is there in output or not. Initially there is uh, nothing inside this output variable. So I'll be traversing uh, this particular string one by one and check if it is present inside this output or not. If it is already present, I'll discard it and if it is not present, I'll add it. So I'll traverse this character first of all, this A. I'll check if it is present here or not. It is not present, so I will add this A to this output. This is not already present inside this output, uh, output object, so I'm gonna add this character. Now I'll move ahead and check if this a is already present in output or not. A is already present in output. I'll discard it. I'll move further ahead. I'll check if A is present in output or not. A is present. Then I won't add it to output again and I'll discard it. I'll move ahead. A is already present. I won't add it. I'll discard it. Now there is B. Okay. B I'll check if it is present in output or not. B is not present. A is present. B is not present. So I am going to add it here. So I am going to write B here. And then I will move ahead. B is already present. I will discard it. B is already present. I will discard it. This B is already present. I will discard it. When comes C, C I will add it because C is not already present inside this output object. The rest of the C's will be discarded because these are already present in the output. Okay, then comes D and D will be added to this variable or object and rest of the D's will be discarded. So this is how we are going to approach and this is how we, we are going to solve this problem. Now we have a roadmap. We just need to code for this particular problem. Let's see how we can code for this. Firstly, I'll be taking a user input. So for that, I need input function. Inside input function, I'll be writing this me message, enter a string. Okay, enter a string and I will save this user input inside my string data object. Okay, then as discussed, firstly, I need an empty output. Okay, so I'll be using output equals to empty string okay now i am going to traverse the string one by one for that i'll be using loop for each character in string data for each character in string data i need to keep a check if the character not present in output then add it otherwise discard it so what i'll do is if ch not in output then what i need to do is add to the output output equals to output plus ch okay so i am adding this character to output if it is not already present inside this output okay so this is it the rest of the case i are going to be discarded and now i'm going to print original string original string is in another argument this is string data and this is how we print the data this is going to be printed as it is and this is going to be replaced by the user input and now print 
result after removing duplicate characters okay so another argument and output now this output at runtime will be replaced with the output string okay the data inside the output so let me save this and run this okay test.py enter a string a a a a a b's and so many c's and so many d's okay enter original string and the result after removing duplicate characters a b c d you can actually try another method for this particular problem here we are using output string we can also do this with with a list okay so i'll be using an empty list list 1 equals to an empty list okay we are doing nothing but we are just taking an empty list and we will leave this original data as it is we will traverse the string again for ch in string data so we will traverse the string in each and every case because we need those characters so for each character in string data if ch not in where list 1 now we are taking a list so if ch is not already present in list 1 i'm going to add it for adding any character or any item inside the list we need append function or append method so we'll be using append method and inside the append method i'm going to pass this character so that this list gets filled with the new characters okay now we are ready and i'll be printing this list 1 as it is if i'll print list 1 as it is the items will not come in the form of a string because the list will show the output something like this inside the square brackets and the items like a comma something like this and so on okay so we don't want that so we would like to have another string so that we get the required output output number 2 Output number two is equal to blank string or empty string dot join method, and inside the join method, I'm gonna be writing list number one. Now, what I'm doing here is I am joining all the items present inside this list one using a separator. Here, I am specifying an empty string. That means I don't need any separator to to join. the items of list one okay so this is an empty string dot join method and inside join method i need to specify list number 1 which is having my required output but i want my output in the form of string that is why i am doing this now i'll do one thing i'll copy this and i will write output number 2 so here i'll be writing result number 1 and result number 2 okay and output 2 is also here let me save this and let me clear this first of all now let's run this enter a string a's and b's and c's and d's and e's okay now observe the output if we print the list as it is see this is in the list form each and every character is present inside the square bracket okay we don't want that we we want the string back we want uh, the output to be in the string format so the original string is this result number 1 after removing duplicate characters is this and result number 2 after removing the duplicate characters is this and both these results are same as you can see so this is the end of today's video if you are having fun learning with me please like my videos and subscribe to my channel mv's code guide please keep learning and keep supporting thank you